Hey guys, glad you're here. So uh, I just got done finishing my second video. Uh, I, I was putting it together editing and I forgot how um, hard it is to edit. I know that sounds silly. I know some people would be like, oh, that's really easy. Uh, I used to know how to do editing back in college. Like I do know how to do basic editing, but I'm not really good at advanced editing. And going through this video, and I'm sure with a lot of practice and time, uh, I'll get better and faster and quality will improve. Um, so I probably spent an hour or so, uh, well, I actually recorded the video yesterday, and I started putting it together today. Uh, so it took me maybe, I don't know, maybe 20 minutes to record. Now it's taken me about an hour or so to edit everything. And I take a look at it, and it's really not too bad. Um, what I need to figure out, do is timing. And, you know, I know that if you make a video, if you want it to be flashy or something like that, um, you got to try to make sure that you're not just staring at me. Like in my case, uh, I'm putting still frames and video uh, and B-roll into these videos. Um, and it's great because I'm learning it. And I think that's going to carry on really good with the bits and pieces stuff, um, especially later on. Because like I said, we we doing some basic editing stuff, but nothing like super huge. But um, I feel really happy to go through and start learning this again, um, just learning the basics. Because I think it's only going to improve things further on and further as we go. Um, again, like I said, uh, yesterday uh, and today, like I, I got a bunch of great feedback from some of my latest videos, um, especially on the daily bit stuff. And uh, I'm hearing you guys. I, I, I really am. And I had a friend that's, you know, he gave me some advice too. Um, you know, we are going to narrow our focus a little bit uh, on bits and pieces, but not really. I think it's going to go really be the same. Like a part of me, like, you're probably thinking like you just want the fame I, I don't really care about the fame i just like on the second channel um i want to be a part of the gaming industry and a lot of people already know this it's nothing new nothing special and uh there's nothing really special about me but um i know some people think that i want to give up on the bits and pieces thing and I, I really can't give that up i've put so much time into bits and pieces that you know it'd be stupid for me to do that um, even if it's not lucrative, it's still something that I care about. Um, and you know, like I said, with this new channel, I can actually, uh, enhance the experience on the bits and pieces stuff. And, you know, whenever we talk about random things like, uh, aliens or, uh, auditors or something like that, conspiracy theories and mental health, like, um, I think that would be a pretty good way of doing it I uh, honestly like I know another thing is like um, mental health is hard to talk about really is um, a lot of channels are on YouTube they don't get really any traction because mental health is still kind of a uh, gray area for some odd reason a lot of people have, like dismisses mental health and you know throughout the term of this channel like I always wanted mental health to be a part of it and, you know, whenever I created a new channel, I was thinking, well, so maybe we're going to do something with mental health on that. I still think I'm going to carry over mental health, but as, as it is right now, like on that new channel, uh, I don't want to scare anybody away quite yet. Um, I do want it to be known that this is a mental health type channel, but still focusing on gaming. Um, it's a hard sell, it really is a hard sell, and it's not a lot of people are successful with it because, like I said, a lot of people still think it's taboo and they're just like uh, dismissing mental health and all. And like I said, this is what the Bits and Pieces channel was always about, was like mental health and uh, doing other stupid things that I enjoy, uh, like rather than Pokemon and video games and now the auditors and stuff like that. And, you know, I, I do want to tie some stuff in together, like to make it last like if you take a look at my background i still have the bits and pieces sign up so that's not going down right so like, like i said a lot of people think i'm just going to quit uh that channel and come you know quit this channel and go back to the other one which I, it's not because i like i said i have a lot of you on here that uh genuinely cares about me and cares about what i have to say and i don't want to lose that um and some people said i was their favorite content creator and my heart like grew like three sizes kind of like the grinch like just like pumped and pumped and pumped 
Uh, my wife has been really supportive. Um, you know, uh, yeah, she's been really su supportive about it. And like I said, it's just going to be pretty, pretty cool to uh, combine this stuff together, uh, work in tandem to make things better on both channels. Because um, I do want to take this seriously, right? I do want to take it seriously. It's been so long. I never really took it completely seriously. I always consider it as like a side thing. But I do want to make a difference, like in both things. Like, so, you know, me making the change to uh, quality over quantity, which that's what's going to happen too. It's going to be quality over quantity because, you know, I could put a bunch of low low level stuff on a channel. Uh, every single day and nothing happens with it because you're just going to take a look and one person will be like oh this is kind of crappy quality then they're like oh the whole channel is like this um so we're, we're gonna we're gonna improve things on and on and we're gonna put more effort into things especially when we do our exercise stuff as soon as we start doing the bits and places and uh, all the other stuff we're gonna do like interviews and all this stuff on this channel um, and we're going to still make it grow. I'm hoping both channels grow. Um, I have noticed a little bit of growth uh, recently. Uh, maybe a few, you know, maybe 10, 12 people every once in a while. Um, I hope you guys don't leave. I really don't. I hope I don't scare you away. Because, like I said, I'm, I'm trying. I'm trying. And um, the whole Reddit thing has been eye-opening, as well as all the comments. It's been really eye-opening for me. Um, and it's in a good way. And I know I've been beating myself up on this, but, you know, it's true. It's like, uh, it's been really helpful to put a new perspective on things. So, all right, guys, feel free to hit that subscribe button. I'll see you soon.